sorry. Excuse me. Sir, Mr. Development Leader of Men. Oh my God. I figured out the mystery with John and the comb. I can't wait to tell you. And send. <sighs> what? Come in. I received your email. I have to say I was a bit um, surprised. Most people would never dare to send me such an email. So, I guess I just have one question. What is up with John and the comb? Oh! Um, well, yes. So, earlier this week, I saw John drop a comb out of his pocket. Okay, first of all, what? <laughs> Why would a bald man have a comb? That's what I was wondering. <laughs> then, when I tried to give it back, he denied the comb was his. <laughs> okay, now this is just getting weird. So, I come in this morning. Oh, this is today. Oh, I I'm sorry, I'm interrupting. Uh, you go. Then I'm in the parking garage, and I see him sitting in his car, combing his bald head. Why, I'm freaking out right now. Oh, I could flip. I'm not done. This is where it gets really weird. He started combing an invisible ponytail. High and tight aside. Hard to say, but I could tell he was imagining bangs. <laughs> now that is haunting. <laughs> oh, by the way, have you ever noticed how in meetings he always says, oh, oh I was just thinking that. You know, I was just thinking oh, that. I was just thinking that. I was thinking oh, that. Oh, really, I was. I was thinking that. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.